don't remember what the last update was for the house but I do remember the last thing was something to do with the windows and the sliding doors um, so I just wanted to show you um, maybe I should go into the different room because this room is a little less cluttered um, this is the office so far we've got our L-shaped desk which helps us work together in the same space um, here's my laptop and then there's Steve's and um, yeah we we have the fireplace over here which again not so flippin nice but it is what it is but um, the sliding doors um, have the trim up so if you look there there's the beautiful trim that's been put around which is nice and modern and bright and white um, so yeah I really like it a lot it's nice and like sharp corners um, and yeah, I think it looks really good. You know, the, the windows look really nice. Yeah, I mean, you get the gist of it. Um, it's just to warm things up because on the outside it's black and then on the inside it's a nice warm tone, not warm tone, like a cool tone pecan brown, but it's not like too cold, not too warm. I don't know, I think it's a really beautiful color. Um, kind of gives me like boho vibes, but also, just classic vibes in a sense of it'll never be really lame or boring um, in terms of the future. This store will be changing next week. I believe it's going to be installed and I'm so excited to show you what the store will look like because um, it's such a sexy door and it will be black because um, I, I didn't want it to be dual toned. I know it's like brown on the inside for the windows and then black on the outside but i was like wouldn't it be weird to have a dual tone front door because it opens so you see both sides at the same time as you're opening and closing it um so yeah we're not doing that um she's hiding away because the countertop guys are here which is the next thing i want to tell you about um, the countertops are being installed today. They couldn't come yesterday because something happened to them. Um, and they're gonna knock on the door. All right, so I just let them in. They're about to do the countertop installation and I'd like to show you that process. Um, we're doing waterfall countertops, so that's really, really, really exciting. And I'm like, oh, oh I need this to be like ready, rock and roll. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> so it's a little brighter because it was like storming like crazy early on. Don't even know how and why that happened because it said it wasn't going to rain. But we have our first counters, countertop in. Here's our sink. And then, well, that's not in yet, but yeah, it fits. And then here is the stove. And I guess you can kind of see the seam over here. It doesn't look that great. I mean, you can see the line, which I thought it would look nicer. I'm assuming they're not done with it because it, it doesn't look that great. 
Yeah. So they obviously need to make that look nicer. So I'll talk to them about that. And then I guess, I don't know where they are right now. Maybe they're having lunch or something, but they're obviously going to be coming back to to the island. <laughs> As if so this is the island space. Unfortunately, based on the, this side was fine. This side was a little short. And I think it's just because maybe, well, the main reason is our floor slopes downwards towards this way where Steve's standing. Um, just due to the age of the home, the floor, you know, it, it's not perfect. It's not like perfect. And you'll never find a house that's like a perfect 90 degree angle so that's just the way it is but um yeah so this is the waterfall style over here they're just letting it set and then this is the um other side and then here is the missing piece which was too short and it wasn't touching the ground so they're recutting it um to be like as best as they can get it but otherwise this is it we still love it <laughs> we still love it and you know we love the counter we the um good. yeah they're he's yeah. finishing that up okay yeah. yeah he's gonna do this uh he's gonna polish this end on that side probably round that okay. out so it's not so yeah, sharp I right. feel that That's yeah i mean it's very sharp and then he's gonna come and redo this part later. Too. Okay, yeah, because so he folded details. in and then he kind of, you know, put it down. And then there's some spots you can see there that need to be redone, just because everything's in phases, I guess. And since he has to come back, it doesn't really matter as long as it sets. But yeah, this is it, and I'm very, very excited about it. I'm very happy about it. So far, so good. I literally have no idea what the last update was. I'm pretty sure it had something to do with the countertops, but completed. Clum completed all. It is officially on. So we've got our waterfall countertop. Isn't it so gorgeous? Oh, yes, baby, yes. Isn't that so stunning? <laughs> okay, so these are our little wee basket lamps that will hang up over here. So we put that on the island for the electricians to uh, put that in we um, have our sink rocking and rolling um, the only downside to the sink um, uh, is that the electrical isn't in yet so 
then sink red obviously isn't working yet because those things still need to be electrified um this is hooked up they had to um They had to put a notch out at the back, which we were okay with doing because of the gas line at the back. Um, you know, with the drawers being this design, three drawers, um, they usually would say like, you shouldn't put a drawer on top just because of the gas line. But I was like, nah, I'm cool with that being notched out at the back. Um, so, that is that. Um, this is our new stove top, which is uh, from Amazon, and it was like four hundred and fifty something dollars um, plus tax, which I don't know what it was, but yeah, it looks really pretty. I feel pretty decent considering the price. Um, yeah, we're gonna use our old one, but then I changed my mind, and I found a good deal, so. You can't shout at me. This was the one that we were gonna reuse. And it's all sticky and gross. But yeah, that was the old one. See the knobs are all malted over there by that one little spot over there. So I was just like, you know what? We're gonna be having a new kitchen. So I want new appliances. The only appliance we actually kept was this one because it really is pretty new. Like. Yeah, there was seriously no issue over there. Um, so, they'll have to uh, put the hose to this and then the electrical isn't yet complete in the island either, which this is this side. And the fridge has not yet been put in, but obviously the stove is in, oven is in, and then the fridge is not yet put in. But that is all put in, which is the trim of that side. And then he put it in on this side, but he has not yet finished this side yet. So he still needs to do that. We're actually going to be um, officially putting our glassware into the kitchen. <sighs> what do we need? I'm gonna unbox all the glassware, all the pots and the pans and the crockery and all that stuff. And we're gonna figure out where we should put it. Um, actually, yeah, he... So, now obviously we don't have any um, knobs yet to open up the doors, but this is very cool. I want to show you this. These slide out. Hello. So you don't have to like, you know, go to the back and try and see where everything is. It's got a lot of scratch over there. But yeah, like you don't have to like reach in and like try and figure out where everything is. You can just be like, um, where's all my stuff? Oh, there it is. So that's nice. I'm pretty chuffed. I'm very, very chuffed. So the one thing that isn't in here, which I believe is because they couldn't figure it out, is this compartment drawer. It's uh, for all the utensils, and I suppose they just didn't know how to put it in. Sorry, I don't know. But yeah, I just want to show you the kitchen. And this is the, I think this is the trash can. Oh, we really need knobs because it's really hard to open. And then I think I showed you this, I'm not sure. Oh, oh, it's really hard to open without the knob. Spice wrap. What's in here? Are these also slidey outies? Oh yeah, these are also slidey outies. So yeah, just want to show you a little bit of the kitchen. Oh, and he, uh, the countertop guy, gave this to us. It's like a little gift 
like a cutting board, which I think is pretty cute because it's still the same design, so it won't look like ugly. I know, we'll see. I already showed them that. But it's working now. Oh, wait. Oh, hey, hey. <laughs> That's so cool. It's a so it has to be on there, right? Yeah, it has right. to be on. And then That's pretty nifty. Technological house over here. <laughs> With our Wi-Fi stove. Yeah, we have a Wi-Fi stove. Oven. That's so I mean oven. I always say that. We both say that. Ugh. But yeah, <sighs> so exciting.